All right, today we're just going. We're just going to be fun. We're just going to be fun, and we're going to be funny. We're going to be on this here Reddit r slash funny memes. Okay, name that character. The amount of screen time they had versus their popularity. That's very very funny. There are. I don't know, man. Like, I know it's supposed to be funny. It's a funny video, right? There's actually a lot to this right here because there's some characters who were were bit. Uh, players in whatever game or show or movie they were in that have tons of lore behind them like tons of lore and it's like they showed up for a couple episodes whatever i mean hell look at senator armstrong from metal gear rising i mean dude's got memes on memes on memes he, he was he was in it for about an hour and a half maybe when your girlfriend has pain in her feet and your masculinity is not fragile i mean I'm not saying I wouldn't, I just know that I would bust my ass horribly. I mean, I don't know, those, the platform's on the left. I mean, I, I might be able to work in those. I'm not rocking stilettos, though. <laughs> They're just, there ain't no part of me that's rocking stilettos. Captain's Log, day 39. Roasted unicorn is delicious. Well, there you go. That's all you needed to know. I saw a thing once that said, you know, honestly, if you're thinking about it, what makes more sense? A horse with a, a single horn on its head? Or a draft with like a, a freaking 19 foot long neck, you know, a freaking that that thing. So, I mean, it's not un unthinkable to think that unicorns may have existed at some point. Maybe not with tattoos on their butt, but I mean, you know. Name something you learned in school you have never used in your adult life. Hmm. Uh, matrixes, proofs in general, geometrical proofs. Mitochondria being the powerhouse of the cell. Uh, I could go on. I, I've, I've yet to use an ounce, a, a, a molecular ounce of chemistry in my adult life, which is good because that was my worst subject. I could go on, but you, you get that. We, we all know what this is going toward, right? We, <laughs> you won't know how to balance the checkbook. You won't know how actual banking works, but you will, you will learn all about, as far as economy goes, this, this country can make this many apples and this country can make this many bears to this many apples. So therefore, they need to trade with each other so many apples for so many bears so that that way they can have the com comparative advantage or whatever. It's like, just tell me how to make money so I don't starve, okay? Tell me, tell me how to have a bank account. Tell me how the F to do taxes, because I still don't know how the F to do taxes. Somebody, <laughs> somebody is very, very tired, <laughs> just sick and tired of uh, public urination. Don't do it, or we'll cut your almonds off, and then you'll have the Metal Gear Solid bleep at the end of it. Man's got denied a plate and walked off. Hungry photographer deletes all photos and leaves after being denied food at wedding. I'm not going to sit here and pretend to know the ins and outs and the intricacies of this story, but it does seem like if you're paying this gentleman a whole bunch of money to you know, film one of the, the most significant days of your life, maybe you could break off a spring roll for him, you know? Just just help him out a little bit, right? You're not charging your other guests, are you? So why are you, why are you denying him? Then again, this is like a level of petty that I don't know won't give him some what he call legal trouble in a few months. But it'll, it'll be fine. Prove your point now, and we'll worry about how we're gonna deal with this later. Has no legs, climbs Mount Everest. What's your excuse? His legs won't hurt. Mine will. You got a point. Uh, for the bags under your eyes, I don't have very big bags under my eyes, but. We're going to try out this product today because that's what we do. So my friend suggested you just cut it in half. And then you take the Habana roll. The Habana, the Habana roll. Put, rub under your eyes. Is that a Habanero? And give it just a, just give it a few. Uh, no. <laughs> no. What is that? Here's the thing. The noises you made were funny, and I'm gonna laugh at you because you should have known better. If that was, did you say, uh, uh, but I can't even say the word, uh, habanero, habanero, whatever, I, you said it a funny way. Anyway, the fact that you rubbed any spicy pepper, much less a damn habanero or whatever you said, under your eyes like... Why would you do that? You know, I've thought about doing like the hot chip challenge or whatever, but I would probably die 
So I'm not going to hurt myself for likes and views. Sorry, I did think about it, but I'm not, I'm not going to do that. And especially bags under my eyes. You know what? I'll just have bags under my eyes, okay? A baby's laughter is one of the most beautiful sounds you will ever hear. Unless it's 3 a.m., you're home alone, you don't have a baby. Huh. Mike, I know you think your truck is totally sick, but this is what I think of your precious 4x4 oh, hang out all day with your stupid friend's truck! Push it! <laughs> you can't kill him. You can't kill him. You can't kill him. You tried. You tried. You can't do it. You absolutely can't do it. I remember on Top Gear, it wasn't the Tacoma, but it was, I think, the Hilux or whatever. Hilux, however you pronounce it. And they, like, did everything. Submerged it, lit the some bitch on fire, crushed it, ran over it with a bunch of stuff. Um, I think they literally, like, set it on fire, and the thing still drove. What a feeling. If they want to get dirty, they may as well clean the floor. That's not a bad idea. Of course, they're probably going to puke and crap all over the floor too, but I mean, at least they can be self-cleaning in the process. And yes, absolutely, that is how you're going to have 20 years of work experience at the age of 20. Here's a little boomer humor for everybody. Kids riding in cars today with seat belts, how dare, and bubble wrap seems a tad excessive, and look how miserable they are because they're not knocking on death's door at every waking second. Uh, kids riding in the car when I was a kid. See, I'm not obviously that old, but e even even w when I was a youth, right, I put my seatbelt on and I just rode in the car and I was okay with it, you know? I didn't crawl up in the, the back of the car like a damn cat lounging in the sun and expect for everything to be okay. We didn't have car crashes when I was a kid. That's only something they invented here in the past few years, damn millennials. You can't hear images. <laughs> Our team is well endowed to guarantee your pleasure. My, my McDonald's. How very Ford of you. Would you rather have the best sex of your life or the best meal you'll ever eat? Meals last longer than five minutes. And this next song is called Stop Eating My Fruit Snacks After You Bang My Mom. Look, kid, she bought those for both of us, okay? And I'm not going to have you and your tiny little first act guitar tell me that I am not allowed to help myself to the pantry, okay? When you know someone is lying, but you can't say anything because of how you found out, so, in a circular sort of way, you're also lying because you actually know that the lie is in fact a lie, but you can't say anything about it because to do so would be to tell the truth of the nature of how you found out about it. So in a way, you're sort of passively lying about the situation in order to perpetuate the lie, right? But not really, I know how this is, it freaking sucks. There had to be a couple seconds on that medieval torture stretcher rack where it felt freaking incredible. And you know what? I agree, man. Crack me like a glow stick. My back needs it. Incorrect password. Please enter new password. New password cannot be old passwords. How many goddamn times? The eyes are the windows to the soul. Me? <laughs> yeah, if only. If only. Think air is free? Buy a bag of chips. What you've said is technically correct. But I still hate that you said it. How do you like your steak? <laughs> Same way I like my sex. Oh, so very rare then? <laughs> it's so funny. <laughs> Such goddamn comedians. No. Raw is how I like my steak. Raw. Same way I like mine. And that's the way that we're going to end this video. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you appreciate it. I hope you had a laugh at this funny memes video. I know it's memes. Be, be careful. Be cool. It's, it's fun. It's okay. It's fun. Anyway, thank you very much again. Like, share, comment, subscribe. And until next time, bye.